Thanks so much, Jonathan. Looking forward to hopefully getting back to some cooler temperatures really, really soon. We take a look outside now. 8.05 on this Friday morning. Beautiful temperatures outside. I would say our traffic, it's okay. Not as beautiful, but we'll take it. This is I-10 Katie at Washington right now. You can see quite a bit of activity on the roads. We've got lots of cars um, out and about early this morning, so we definitely are seeing some congestion in some areas, but it's very patchy. Wanted to bring to your attention, and we'll talk more about road closures a little later in our show before nine. We see that 45 South HOV lane on Gulf Freeway is going to be closed. That's until Monday. However, all the other um, HOV and HOT lanes will be open, so keep that in mind. We go back to our traffic map here. We notice that there is still quite a bit of congestion that's within our inner loop. Typical for this time of the morning, we'll see more relief as we approach 9 o'clock. We do see along here, I would say going towards um, Highland Heights, and we also see towards spring. Things are a little lighter than what we saw earlier, so that is interesting to see, but we will take it, however, within our inner, inner loop. However, on 45, like I mentioned, very red there. We also see a few areas that are still giving us some trouble, including some breakdown. So the left-hand shoulder is blocked to assault via on 290 westbound that's at Mason Road keep that in mind we also see things near Jersey Village becoming a little lighter than what we saw earlier as well so we'll take it also Greens Road at JFK Boulevard seeing an accident still lingering there we talked about that a little bit earlier 45 northbound at exit 51 to 610 westbound speeds of 55 miles per hour we'll take it that's not too bad either so we'll have more updates for you coming up make sure you don't go anywhere we'll have those drive times for you after the break